midnight on Saturday, September 3rd, we were officially locked out of the university. We lost access to email, course management websites. Our salary was terminated. Our health insurance was terminated. One of our faculty has a very, very sick daughter, a life-threatening disease. She cannot get health care for her daughter. We are at a crossroads historically. Never before has an administration taken unilateral action to say to its faculty, you're not allowed on the campus, you're not allowed to teach your courses. The lockout enrages me. It is a stunning example of disrespect for the faculty and for the students. Today is the first day of classes and our students are going to class and they're being taught by replacement workers, they're being taught by administrators. I walked into my class. This is an upper level division course for chemistry majors only. And this guy just walked in and he introduced himself as an IT staff member and he'll be teaching our class until further notice. That made me feel very incompetent in terms of receiving my degree here within, in this May. We were supposed to have lab today too, but he's not qualified to teach lab, so we left. John teaches fiction at LIU, and uh, John is the uh, professor whose class I was assigned to teach when I was asked to. To me, this was a ethical line that I could not cross uh, and uh, didn't feel comfortable working for a place that would cross it. I turned in my resignation. I don't see how you can knowingly pay $40,000 for an academic year, know that faculty teaching you is underqualified, and be okay with that. We've got a lot of students who have theses, who are applying to graduate school and can't get recommendations, and who just want to come here and learn, and they can't do it right now. Students, faculty, staff, unite, same struggle, same fight. See, we're asking all of our students, we're going to sit down and talk about the things that we want. One thing we know we want is our professors back on campus to teach us in the classroom. That's the students, they were holding uh, signs in support of the faculty and the security guards told them that they could not come in. To me, that this university is alienating the students. If the administration is allowed to get away with what they're doing here today, breaking the, the union and undermining the education of the student body, they're, they're going to be able to do it anywhere they want across the country. We cannot allow LIU to break the backs of workers! to break the backs of students. This is about a lot of things. It's about justice, it's about economic security, it's about academic autonomy and integrity. We want to bargain in good faith, and I would say, you know, show us the respect for our profession. Sit down with us in a reasonable way. We want to go to work. We've always wanted to go to work. This unprecedented, hostile, malignant move has, as you can see, it's mobilized us, it's organized us, it's united us. We're here. And you can hear out there what's going on too.